Git is the best version control system. It tracks files, preferably source files, but Git doesn't care. These files are generally called the workspace. This is a commit tree. It's what Git both creates and uses for various functionality. This tree is usually shown with time increasing bottom to top, meaning newer commits are here and older commits are here. Every circle is a commit. Every line is a parental relationship. Commits simultaneously represent both an instant of source code in time and a set of changes to files in that instant. Parental relationships define when commits were made relative to other commits and fully define the structure of the tree. This commit has one parent and this commit has two parents. This is your git repo. It's young and it's called hello and it's showing its tracked files for all to see. How embarrassing. Tracked files are the files the repo was told to care about, shown in white. Untracked files are essentially social outcasts, shown in gray. The red arrow represents what commit you're currently checked out to. Git stores its entire history in the hidden .git folder at the top of the repo. You have to whisper because it's hidden. Don't edit those files, okay? This is a git tag. It's a way to label a particular commit. This is a git branch. It's a tag that moves when you make a commit on it. This is a non-fast forward git merge. This is a fast forward git merge. This is a git rebase. This is a git fetch. This is a git cherry pick. This is a git log and this is a git clean. This is git status. It's like asking your repo what's up. This is a modified file. This is an untracked file and this is a modification in your index. The index is like a checkpoint. Git is decentralized. You have the full history of the project and so does everyone else, so get over it. Other repos you communicate with are called remotes. One remote is typically established as the authoritative remote. We call this the origin. GitHub is the origin for approximately 11 million projects and GitLab is also gaining popularity fast. In Git, making a commit is a local action. Commits are shared with a remote through Git push and from a remote through Git fetch. Congratulations, you are now a Git expert. If you like this video or want to learn more, make sure to check out my other videos and don't forget to subscribe. I'm Dan the Git School Dude and I'll see you next time.